Hey guys, welcome back everyone. We're back. Yeah, Outlast. For the third time on this channel. Third time. I haven't played this game. It's been a year, once again. And if you guys remember, I was very shitty and I have to continue, but we'll go on the new game. So we'll restart. Everything's fresh. I'll read everything. I want to get immersed in this game and we're going to be doing it. I'll be putting a pause on The Evil Within because I'm finally getting ready to uh, do live streams and everything. I've been finally getting everything, so I'm getting a better setup. And you'll see you soon. I'll do a video on it, and it's gonna be awesome. But for now, let's do this. Outlast contains intense violence, gore, graphics, sexual content, and strong language. Please enjoy it. <laughs> you are Miles Upshur, an investigative reporter who ambition, whose ambition is about to earn him an intimate tour of the hell on Earth. Always, will, always willing to risk digging into the stories no other journalist would dare investigate, you will seek out the dark secrets of the heart of Mount Massive Asylum. Stay alive as long as you can. Record everything. Oh. Record everything. You are not a fighter. To navigate the horrors of the Mount Massive and expose the truth, your only choices are to run, hide, or die. Awesome. I love this game. It's just awesome. It's awesome. I keep looking there, but I don't look there. Right there. Anyway, the graphics in this game are just... Oh, it's been a while. I don't even remember. Oh my, I mean, I remember a bit, like at one point you have to hide from uh, the big guy. I don't remember any of the jump scares. Like, I didn't even go back to look at my old videos. I should have done that so I could at least progress, but whatever. We're going to do it fair and square. I mean, jump scares are jump scares. You know, I've played Slender many times, and I'm still afraid to play this game. I, I'll, one of my old, oldest videos, I've made a pact to never play a Slender game again, but I'm going to be doing it soon. Spoilers. But, um, no matter how many times I play it, and I keep, I, I know when it's going to happen, I still get scared. I still get scared, no matter what. Like, I take my time, I'll always get scared. It always gets me. And I think I remember a few jump scares, hopefully I can avoid them, but I don't remember. I remember one, there's a guy on a stick, and he's alive? Uh, you know, I don't remember. Who cares? Confidential. September 17th, 2013. From zero... Oh, you, know, you don't know me. How to make this quick. There might be monitoring. I did two weeks of software consult at Murkoff Psychiatric System Facilities in Mount Massive. All sorts of NDAs. I am very much breaking right now, but seriously, fuck those guys. Terrible things happen there. Happening there. Don't understand it. Don't believe half the things I saw. Doctors talking about dream therapy going too deep. Finding something that had been waiting for them in the mountain. People are being hurt and Murkoff is making money. It needs to be exposed. The DLC, the whistleblower, is this. This paper is an email sent by the main character of the whistleblower DLC, which was awesome. It was freaking cool. I think this is what would happen, because in the whistleblower DLC, you have the choice at the end to either expose Murkoff or go with your family or something. like, Or not expose Murkoff or whatever. So maybe this is what happened if you did not expose this whole incident so as you guys can tell the i put on the drapes some green cloth so that the uh the light wouldn't come in because i couldn't record face cam ever because my light would always come in and i'll just put this here maybe to give a oh shit give a little more light to my face so awesome objectives are updated in your reporter's notebook what's in here there was always something in here i remember nope nothing all right now massive asylum i haven't been here in a while Oh, so it's, it's click to open. Camcorder is right mouse button. F is flashlight. Awesome. Oh my god. This is so nostalgic. Oh my god, I didn't even notice that. I never noticed that. That's so crazy. N. I start feeling sick just looking at this place. Mount Madison Asylum shut down amid scandal and government secrecy in 1971. Reopened by Murkoff Psychiatric System in 2009 under the, gui under the guise of a charitable organization. Cell phone reception cut off ab abruptly a mile out, more like a jam than lost signal. The Murkoff Corporation has been as, lo as a lo long track of disguising profit as charity, but never in American soil, never on American soil. Whatever they thought they could get out of this place has to be big. Might finally be the story that breaks the bastards. Ooh, bad words there. I never really read any of these, so. Saving. Am I supposed to go in here? Oh no, Ugh, I'm so stupid. It, it, it's right there. 
the little thingy up there. Fuck, I'm so stupid. I haven't, I've played this like a year, literally a year ago. I think it's the same date. I think it's the same month, April. And yes, I'm getting this big stash. <laughs> I look like a walrus. All right, jump. Jump over. Jump on it. Jump, jump, jump on it, girl. Mm, jump on it. Jump, jump, get up on it. And it, oh. Darkness. My, the darkness is my ally. Yes, really so. I'm bang. Live your soul. Live your soul. You know, this is the, I think, ugh, this was the jump scare that got me in the second time. The, I, every time it gets me. Every time. Isn't this where the guy comes from? Oh, okay. I had a little S moment there. It's here. Oh, battery. Just like punch the battery. Anything else? I'm going to record your awesome gaming setup right here. You have a good setup, man. Great setup. You have a little light to make everything. Don't flicker without my permission, bro. Confidential. Give me that. Jay. Murakov Psychiatric System Project Wall Rider. Mountain Massive Co. Company. Case number seven one seven four patient Billy. Fucking Billy. I think that's a big guy that keeps murdering fucking Billy now. Therapy status. Patient claims to have progressed to self directed lucid dream states. Morphogenic engine activated activity of oh my lord, my freaking pants are un Morphogenic engine activates observed on unpredictable scale. Continuing stage four hormone schedule diagnostics. Spirometry revealed no bronchial accumulation. Hematocrit certifuge again failed to separate. Whoa, erythrocytes, highly worrisome. MRI revealed arrhythmic REM and REM cycle, laughter in REM state. Bruh, that's some complicated ass shit. Oh, somebody's using the bathroom. Oh, sorry, buddy. Ew! I, I, yeah, I remember this thing. That's. Did I just. I just paused that other video. I think it's screwed up. I hope not. Battery. Because I'm gonna have to restart all this. I don't feel like doing that. Because then I'll know when the jump scares are, which sucks. Alright, I took a battery. Oh, jeez! Oh, god! Yo, scare the shit out of me. I saw, like, a little blood drop. Look at that. Look at that. The ceiling bleeds! It bleeds, I tell you! Spider web. Hey, buddy. Don't close the door. I mean, I could go back there and salute the dude, but whatever. And by the way, I look really red. Oh my god. I could climb there. Oh, okay. Saving. Alright, this is the part where. <laughs> You guys enjoy this, don't you? I got many messages saying play the game again for the third time, and I responded to those texts saying, No! This is the third time, and I don't feel like it. I mean, go! There's all these heads. Yeah, that's the guy. That's the buddy boy. They killed us! They caught out! The okay, bye. Oh, is this Billy? Billy! Oh, you're so me. Oh, I think this is where he gets me. Little fake. Oh! Scared the shit out of me, his nipple. And I get thrown out of the winder. I got thrown out of the winder. Oh, no, it's Father George. And who are you, then? Or whatever his name is. The Psycho Priest. So how y'all been doing? You been doing good? I've been doing good. Growing some of that stash. I, I see. Merciful, Merciful God. God, you have sent me an apostle. Guard your life, son. You have a calling. Or I just get wrecked this whole way through. <laughs> It took me like a good while for him to get there, talk to me, and then for me to get back up. 
Whoa. New objective, escape the asylum, access security controls. Oh, oh, that jumped out. What's up, officer? What's up, officer? Oh my god, yo, his pupils are black. Oh my god. Oh, cover this. No. What the shit? Oh my god, I have to fix that. I'm gonna have to fix that, though. Jay. Work off corporate United States officers like a weather scenario. I haven't made it to the board directors. We are satisfied with the uh, infinitive and testimony established sufficient evidence of the rigorous agent actions of the part of the M M MHS and grounds for the insurance of this warrant. You are hereby required to grant MHS full access to all facilities and, facilities and surrender complete authority to its agents. By acceptance of this document, you and any surviving relatives surrender all claims of litig lit litiga litigation against the Murkoff Corp or its sub subsidiary subsidiaries for the actions of MH MHS or the circumstances which required their actions regardless of responsibility. Christ. Murkoff is one stupid ass motherfucker. Where am I supposed to go? Okay, let's start by going here. Oh! Okay, he's. I don't think he's a bad enemy. This is. Double bathroom. Okay. Blood. Witness. <laughs> the dude's dead, he's taking notes. Look at this. The witness. I'm already beat up, beat all, all to hell, picking broken glass out of my scalp. Ew. Couple cracked ribs, nearly killed by a deformed giant. Looks like somebody trying to fuck start his head with a cheese grater. He throws me through a wall, knocks me unconscious. I wake up and some do doughy old man with a face like an alcoholic kitty fiddler in a homemade priest outfit calls me his apostle. Not a job I ask for. There are words scrawled in blood everywhere. I'm getting an ugly feeling in my gut that's a, that the priest is, is writing them. And for my benefit. Oh, Christ, that's creepy. So wait, the priest killed this guy? I never knew. Oh. He wants my hand. Need a hand? Oh, but the head is there too. I keep clicking out. They're all black. No, like their eyes. Don't. It's not racist. I didn't mean that. Okay. What the shit? Oh, battery. Battery, battery, battery. Oh, it's this. Okay. Christ, that scared me. Was it closed before? Hello? 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 Nobody there. What's this? This door needs a key card. Yeah, well, if it needs a key card, why even check? Yeah, what's in here? Nope, can't open. What is in here? Oh, confidential. I keep clicking out. I have to fix this. What is it? Dear sirs, the full report pending no immediate action is required of the part of the Murkoff Corp. The profit potential of Project Wall Rider remains stra staggeringly high. The four fatalities contain enough ambiguous data to make an any limitation. Litigation. Sorry, I'm Professor Oak. <laughs> if evidence is correctly managed, impossible. Project Wall Rider remains a dangerous initiative, and though I spat so much, and there will almost certainly be further casualties. As with the others, however, family and government interests in the pa okay, I'm stopping at this place. It's so low to make any chance of legal actions vanishing unlikely. Violence among the patients is increasing the morphogenic end therapy, getting closer to producing remodels. The combination of physical and chemical restraints have proven sin sufficiently effective to assure control and profit. Make off legal option part. Oh god, dude. Oh my god. He knew he he forgot how to plank and oh yeah, you see he was planking. He was planking and he screwed up. <laughs> the dude was planking and he just like had a fatality on his desk. <laughs> oh my god, poor guy. Is there any more water? Oh my god. I'm freaking thirsty right now. Thirsty ho. I have to shave. I really do. My mustache is really uh, irritating my, my skin right now. Very irritated. 
very irritated. Is there anything? <gasps> Ooh. Confidential. J. Customization. Oh. Patient initials. C.W.L. Walker. Gender male. Patient age 32. Observing physicians. Dr. Rudolf Wernick. Or Wernicke. Therapy status. Morphogenic engine activity platoid at roughly 2,000 ppm. Shut your mouth already. Unsafe to progress beyond stage 3. Hormone schedule. Diagnostic spirit. Spirometry revealed light to medium bronchial, bronchial um, accumulation. MRI scans consistent to the patient's reported dreams. Walker has interviewed, has interviewed in restraints. Following his self-inflicted mutilations, restraints have been, I had to alter to accommodate his enormous size. Oh, so this is the big guy. Okay, so Billy isn't that. Isn't this guy? Since the dermal eruptions and consistent with. Wait one second. No, it's it, Billy's a different guy. Fellow morphogenic engine cellular activity. He claims the skin ripped off. He claims the skin ripped from his forehead allows for a truer way of seeing. Seems to have some boyhood experience with Tuatara lizards and their peridial eyes. He has expressed anxiety about his flesh, specifically around his lips and nose. Attending orderly should be advised to watch for further self mutilation. The mental traumas have. He's staying while serving in Afghanistan. Seemed to be re retarding, retarding progression of the ME. Pro okay, pause and read. I've been taking too much time on on that. So, are there any batteries I can I can borrow? I have five batteries. Oh shit, Pete. <gasps> There's a dude there. Oh shit. Oh, God. Please don't kill me, buddy. Please. <gasps> Is there a vent? Maybe I have to go in the vent. No? Don't kill me. Oh god. Oh. It's a nice it's a nice program y'all got there. It's a vi I see some shit in there. Anyway. Oh hello sir. What's up, homie? Alright. Everybody Oh, I took notes. A crowd of broken men watching a dead channel. They look like patients, they survived whatever happened. Here, but nobody's home. Okay. Okay. Hey, what's in here? <gasps> what's that? I think that's where the key card is, right? Yeah. Is there any batteries I really want? No? All right. So I'm going to leave it off here. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you guys have enjoyed episode one. This has been crazy. I already got a jump scare like three or four times already. And I just forgot the game. Literally. And we have so much to come. But, oh, thank you all so much for watching. I'm really happy that I did this. I'll be posting the live stream that I did a few minutes ago. A few minutes ago. A few hours ago. I did post a video this morning saying that I was going to do an Extinction on Cod Ghosts live stream. And I did. And it was about an hour or so. So I'll be editing it and processing it and rendering it. So I can po be able to post it on YouTube so that you guys can enjoy it as well. For those who will miss the stream, it'll be able to be on YouTube very soon. I'll try, as my, I'll try my best to render it as, much as, as fast as possible. But in the best quality as possible. So thank you all so much for watching. And I hope you guys had a great time today i had with this awesome scary moment and i thank you and i hope to see you guys in the next one peace out